Agriculture inspectors in the wine country are on alert now. There's a pest and it's threatening to destroy the wine crop. As CBS 13's Tony Lopez reports, new tonight, the glassy-winged sharpshooter has tried to migrate to Northern California before, and it didn't end well. They put some kind of a bait in there to attract bugs. It may not be the centerpiece of Louis Fopiano's vineyard in Healdsburg, but this bug trap is doing some serious work, saving his livelihood from ruin. You'll lose a vine immediately. I mean, uh, within a year or two years, uh, you'll have a dead vine. The glassy winged sharpshooter is tiny, about half inch, but it can kill plants and vines by spreading Pierce's disease, which cuts off a plant's water supply. Just think of it as mosquitoes and malaria. It's the same, exactly the same thing. We have a $600 million wine grape industry to protect. Assistant Agricultural Commissioner Lisa Correa is waging war against the pest, preventing its spread from Southern California. Warm weather and an early spring has increased the threat. These bright yellow sharpshooter traps, they're a common sight. And every shipment of plants arriving from the Southland is inspected. Recently, eggs from a sharpshooter were found on a cargo shipment. Fortunately, there's a check-in system, and we're able to find it, and we're able to ship the plants back to Southern California, so we don't have the risk here. They look at each leaf and look under the leaves and see if they find any egg masses. Deanna Tubbs at Prickett's Nursery says inspections of new plants happen every week. It may seem excessive, but consider this. The sharpshooter decimated thousands of acres of vineyards in Temecula in 1999, and no one wants history repeating itself here. Mm -mm. That's no, dark. <laughs> Losing the wine and we're short on water. I mean, I want a little hip hip hooray from you out of the weather uh, department. Today. Okay, okay.